Okay, this is an experiment for sure tonight. <laughs> I'm going to make some faux tacos or taco meat with chickpeas. I've made this before, um, but I left the chickpeas whole. Tonight, I'm going to got my new little blender thingy here. The cheap one at Walmart. It's like a bullet, whatever. But anyway, um, I've made tacos with chickpeas before and just left them whole today i'm gonna um, blend them up i'm gonna add a little bit of these cashews to it i bought these on accident everything's seasoned i'm not real i wanted just regular cashews so i'm gonna try to use these up don't really like the first time i open them i'm like oh my god <laughs> There's bugs. They're not bugs. It's, well, like everyday seasoning. You know, that bagel everyday, whatever it is. Everything bagel, whatever. Anyway, homemade taco seasoning. And I watched a video. And let's see if I can do this. I'm going to say it now in case it um, works. Or in case it's a flop. You take the liquid from the chickpeas and you make a like a sour cream with it by using the emulsion blender and i did forget i had this before i bought this <laughs> but i really like my smoothies in here versus with the emulsion but anyway i digress so let's see what happens with this um experiment of um, it's also, I saw on um, some videos online, it can be like a Taco Bell taco. So, let's see if that's true or not, too. Alright, I still have some of those homemade flour tortillas. So, I'm going to make mine and that. And I think Deborah wants corn tortillas. So, we might have a mixture. And I still have a little bit of that pasoli soup. So, I'm going to have warm that up also for my taco okay i'm gonna keep this juice and see if i can't it's okay if some of the chickpeas get in there because i think one of the videos i watched it was really thin so it's more like a crema versus sour cream and maybe the chickpeas will actually thicken it up some I think Sammy used to eat canned dog food because every time I open a can, she's like, is it time to eat? Oh, did I say that word? I know it's getting close, isn't it? Can dogs eat chickpeas? I wonder if you like them. Yes, I looked it up. Dogs can have chickpeas. So let's see if she likes chickpeas. They say in the original form, so... Did you like chickpeas? She says, yeah, it was okay. Well, that's good to know. Of course, all the videos I watched, it was in a food processor. But, hey, we're going to do it in the blender. And we'll probably need a little bit of liquid. I would think. But, you want it. You don't want a smoothie. <laughs> so, maybe not. Let's add a little. One video I watched, they added mushrooms. I don't have any mushrooms. But I have cashews. Alright. Okay, I think that's good enough. I've got still some whole ones in there, but that's alright. I might get a little crunch. If I pick, find a lot of them, I'll pick them out and put them back in there. But I went ahead and did the whole can. Oh, there's some up there. Well, let me try to do some more. Put some oil in the pan. And there is quite a few that are not crunched up. But hey. It's my first time. We'll see. I think I might want to add a little bit of water. And then let it cook down. So add a little bit of water. I don't know. <laughs> and I 
nothing like doing it live on YouTube. Well, it's not live, but I should have done a live. You do a live cook with me. I haven't done that in a while. I guess I can get a fork and mash these ones that didn't mash up. Okay, I mashed up the ones that were not mashed up. I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add the seasoning, and then I'm gonna add some more water. Okay, I'm gonna add a little bit of lemon, lemon juice. Yeah, I can't see it coming out, but it did. And start blending. I'll blend after I stir this. I'll turn it down a little bit. Oh, it's <laughs> it's creamy. It's very thin. That was the other thing. But now I need to add in some oil, and I melted this in the microwave, so I'm going to add that as I blend, so I can't do this on camera. Okay, no. <laughs> it looks okay. Yeah, no. I, that taste is like nothing I want to run my tacos with. It's like, ugh. Okay, if you don't have sour cream, you don't have sour cream. It's better without than trying to make whatever that was. So here's my otaku oh, meat. Take a little bite of that just to see what it tastes like. Put some cheese on it and it's probably going to be good. Maybe I should mix it with some hamburger meat. <laughs> it's okay. I just, the consistency, I think, is what's getting me the chickpeas not being. So I could put it back in the blender and blend it some more. Well, this is where I'm going to leave it. Well, I'm not going to leave it. <laughs> I'm going to let it cool off. I'm going to put it in the refrigerator because I'm kind of over it now. <laughs> And um, I'll come back to it tomorrow. I think I'm going to add some of the um, canned hamburger meat that I have. And um, I had a little bit too much cayenne to this too. So um, that way it will thin that out. And um, it'll make some... I'll just add a little bit. Maybe I'll <laughs> freeze this in chunks and add it to... Anytime I have tacos. But, um, yeah, I'm not really digging it right now. So, I will, um, do something else. Mm -hmm.